Hi, and welcome to our three minute QI on fishbone diagrams. This is a visual tool which helps us to organize our thinking by categorizing the many potential causes of a problem. The diagram has a central spine and several offshooting branches or bones, hence the likeness to a fishbone. The problem is displayed at the head of the fish. Along the spine are the cause categories. These are the high level groupings which you use to organize causes. The categories you choose will depend upon the problem being analysed. The smaller fish bones show all the causes within a category. Most problems we face have more than one cause and some have a large number. So this is a great way to visualise them and acknowledge them all before you choose where to focus your efforts. Your fish bone diagram will help you uncover the many causes of a problem. Ones that stare you in the face and others that are less obvious or even hidden. It helps you break down a problem into small parts, always a good thing. Using categories can also help you see causes that are linked in some way, and you can then decide where to explore further. So here's how to do it. First, sketch your skeleton outline, the head and the spines. Write the problem in the fish's head, and then add some categories you might use for the spine. Remember, these are not fixed for every fish bone, and you can change them if you need different ones. You can then add in all the causes you can think of by writing them on individual post-its and match them to the category that best describes them. You can add or change categories depending on what you find. These are just examples. Change is hard, so take one step at a time. You might want to share your fishbone with others before you decide what to work on. They might add other causes that you've not seen or thought about, and sharing is a great way to engage others to work with you. Here's just some of the things people like you have worked on, and drawn fishbone diagrams to help uncover the causes of problems they face at work every day and want to get started on fixing. We all learn best by doing, so if you think this is something that can help you in your work, take a photo of this worksheet and use it as a guide and apply it to a small problem you face every day. So, in just three minutes you've had a whistle-stop tour of fishbone diagrams and how to use them. We have a whole series of three-minute QI pieces to support you using QI tools and techniques, so why not check out our programmes at www.qiclearn.com.